In this demonstration, we're going to show you how to incorporate a tooltip into your application, and we're going to use a use case where we have a table on the page. We're going to bind it to a data from a business object, and we're going to show, for example, picture name, salary, and maybe job over here. Oh, we want to switch the picture to be an image. And then we figured out this table is a little bit too wide for our use case, so we don't have a place to show the job here. So we want to actually remove it from the table. And instead, we want to show it as a tooltip when you hover, for example, over the name of the employee. Right? So to do that, we're going to use a tooltip component that is available in the Visual Builder component palette. and search for the tooltip and let's install this component. Once the component is installed, back in your user interface, if you scroll all the way down, you would find this under the sample components. So now we can drag and drop the sample components on top of the name of the employee. All right, so now let's look at the structure that we have here. We have a cell template for this column, for the name, and we have a tooltip with two areas. One is the actual um, value that is going to be shown, and then over here we have the tooltip. So what we want to do is we want to modify the text of the tooltip. Instead of showing the data from this field, we want to get data from the row, and specifically we want to get the job like that. Now let's switch over to live mode. If you go over here, you can see Shelly is a manager. And if we go to Sherry, she's a developer. 